And we're back for another episode of Pokemon Uranium. And we're about to face the gym of Venomville Town. It's a skill type gym, and I've done a lot of grinding for it. We have everyone at 32, except Cupid because it's a skill type gym, so Cupid will not be participating. Oh, Razor did learn Leaf Blade though, so that's pretty cool. Oh, you solved my puzzles. Well, whatever. It was getting boring waiting around. This town is so boring. There is nothing to do. These people are so happy farming and praying and stuff. They don't get it. Don't they know that their lives are pointless and inconsequential? Ah, it makes me so angry! My steel types are sick of being in this stupid town. We'll take out our anger on you! Yeah, so technically my level cap was level 32, but I mean 33, but oh my goodness, so wild Pokemon are so low level that I just was like, I'm just going 32, and that's it. And it's working so far. Gawa rule. Oh, wow. Okay, uh. This is pure steel type. We'll head into Terry. Roll out. That does little damage. We'll be fine. Before it gets to be like huge damage, it should be dead to sand too. Okay, that's just depressing. Metal whip. What? Are we trapped now? It's fine because we just set up. And we're at like, I think, plus three or something. I don't know. We'll bullet see just so we don't risk it. Okay, now we might not KO. I can barely see it going to. Oh my god. That's really annoying. We almost died though before with all the rollouts. Like one crit us. Ah! Why am I. I should just attack. Like with other moves. That was a crit. That's how sad this is. Oh, I'm so stupid. I forgot that it's not rock type. I was like, why is Sand Tomb doing so little? It should be four times effective. No, I forgot my types. Even though I literally just said it. Take down. We should kill. We should kill. Come on. Bruh. Ah, oh, that was so annoying. It kept on spamming iron defense. I just had to kill it with like sand to recoil. Call meteor? Um, it looks like a type, so I think we go into razor. Set up seeds. Oh boy. Okay, actually, no, we just have to kill this thing fast before it gets the boost. So, wait, did we miss? Yeah, I think we did miss. We'll just leaf blade twice, hopefully. We won't get HP back, but. I really don't want that thing getting the boost. Whoa, that leaf blade animation is pretty neat. That's the first time I've seen it. Tracton? What type in are you? It doesn't look ground type, but it is a tractor. Should I try Butterball? I think I want to try Butter. Or do I try Tubby? I'm worried this thing has like Fire Fang or something. Shift gear. Uh oh. That's bad. Um. Brick break. Dragon Claw! No, 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 stop! Oh god, oh god, oh no, 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 it's part dragon type. That's scary, okay. Um, back into Razor, I suppose. How much damage is that gonna do? Okay, okay, we live, we live. We Leech Seed, and this should be fine. We're gonna have to rock smash it to death, but you know what? I'll take it after that Dragon Claw to Tubby. All right, it's living on like a smidge. So we'll just Metal Claw to save people. Rookie mistake, that is a that is a classic rookie mistake. I'm ashamed, we're fine. That was pretty scary for a second there. I'm not gonna lie. How, how are you so strong? I don't understand. All I do every day is training, train, and yet some little brat like you marches right in. Well, anyway, you made my day a little less boring. I guess I should give you this. Uh, uh, hey, are you Jackson? Oh, good. Listen, this kid named Terry or something, he's got his Pokemon out and he looks kind of upset. He told me he was looking for you. Can you, uh, make sure he's okay, please? He looks a bit too young to be on his own. He's by the town's entrance. You know, with crazy hair like that, he should be hard to miss. Maybe you should heal up, though. Pokemon look all worn out from battling. Oh, I swear if they make me battle him before I heal. Hey, Theo. Jackson, you already got the gym badge, huh? I tried, but this Pokemon was too strong for me. It's not fair. I just want to be a good Pokemon trainer. I work so hard, training all the time, and then you win anyway. 
You're thinking I'm just a white kid, aren't you? Well, I'm not. I'm not just a kid. Why don't everyone stop treating me like one? How am I supposed to keep fighting after Dad? I, I miss you. Where did you go? Why did Dad's power plant have to blow up? Dad, you told me to be strong. So then, why haven't you called me? Where are you, Dad? Why did you go missing? I need you. What the heck? Did another explosion? Is that radiation? Did you hear that? It sounded like an earthquake. Or... No, it couldn't be. I hear sirens. What's happening? There's no way it could be another meltdown, right? You kids, there's been an emergency. We need to evacuate the entire town. Let's go, Staraptor. Staraptor is my partner Pokemon from the Almia region. It's a swift and strong flyer, so we can carry both of you to Legend Town, where it's safe. Now get on, quick! What? What's going on? What's going on? I can't... I can't explain now. Just go. No! Oh my goodness! That's just an like interesting shot. No way! It can't be! Another nuclear meltdown! Oh, you're safe. Thank Arceus. Follow me. Can everybody hear me? Okay. Good. We're in the middle of a crisis the likes of which Tandor has never seen. Yes, it's as you might have feared. Nuclear power plant Zeta has suffered a meltdown. As we speak, a cloud of radioactive fallout is spreading across Route 8 in Venoville. This radiation is harmful to all life. Weak Rangers are currently evacuating everybody to safety. What the hell? Two nuclear meltdowns so close together? What's going on? This can't be an accident. We can't confirm any rumors right now. We're trying to make sure everybody is safe. What about our Pokemon? Yeah, save our Pokemon. And the ones in the wild, too. Pokemon affected by radiation? They'll go all crazy, don't they? This is awful. Please remain calm. Here in Legend Town, you are safe. You are a safe distance from the Fallout Zone. We're doing our best to contain the spread of radiation. We'll be giving out subway passes so that you may visit family elsewhere in the region. One last thing. I understand you are worried and scared, but as long as we support one another, we'll make it through this. Look after your children and elderly. A ranger will come by soon with food and clean sheets. And to all of you in this room who are Pokemon trainers, we don't usually ask for help from civilians, but as you can see, we're in the midst of a crisis. If anybody has strong Pokemon that can help us battle the nuclear Pokemon on Route 11 to the north, please. Certain kinds of Pokemon, like Steel types, are more effective. You said, you said Steel Pokemon? Look, I know I've been a real jerk in the past. I used to always say I hated Beetleville and everyone in it, but the truth is, I loved that place with all my heart. I just never realized it until now. Now is my chance to prove to everybody that I do care. I'll help the Rangers. Hey, me and Jackson are trainers. We've got gym badges too. You? You're just a kid. Sorry, but we really don't want to put any kids in danger. Stay with your parents, kiddo. Actually, I can vouch that Jackson is a capable trainer. They're strong enough to beat my gym. What about me? I am a good trainer. Let me help. I want to help. Well, okay, I'm not crying for him. Um, kid? Don't call me a kid! There, there, dear. Don't cry. Well, anyway, Jackson was it? If what Sheldon said was true, then we need your help. Come find us at the entrance of Route 11 to the north. We'll make sure that the nuclear Pokemon don't reach this town. Ah, oh, great. I hope there are no fire nuclears. Otherwise, I'm screwed. There's large numbers of nuclear Pokemon out there, and they're vicious. Our rangers are having trouble holding them off. If we don't keep them back, they'll spread their radiation to this town. There's no way we're having that. I'm not going to put any more lives in danger. Suit up. Let's go! Jackson? You're alright. I see. You were in Venoville when it happened. I thought I was sending you out of harm's way. I'm so sorry. I'm glad. I'm so glad you're okay. Now, I'm gonna do the best that I can to make things right, and I'll start by protecting the people of Legend and Venoville. Oh, it's Jackson! I see you sh- I see you showed up to help us battle the nuclear Pokémon. As much as I resent putting you in danger like this, I also want to see your Pokémon battling skills in action. Don't worry, Jack. Wait. Oh, that was the wrong voice. Okay. Don't worry, Jackson. I'll keep you safe, no matter what. Come with me. Listen up, everybody. 
beyond this point is the start of the hazard zone. Most of the side of the hill is sheltered from the fallout, but the nuclear Pokemon are in this area, irrid irradiating the ground as they go. As you know, they are resistant to capture stylers. Using Pokemon to stop them is the most effective way. Pokemon who have trainers are more resistant to the mind-altering effects of the radiation. They also recover more quickly, whereas humans are at greater risk of exposure. The air here is not very toxic because we are far away from the epicenter and protected by the mountain. Still, it is important to be cautious. Is everybody ready? Let's go! Our goal is to subdue the feral nuclear Pokemon and prevent them from reaching the barrier. Additionally, we have word from rangers who have discovered some people with Pokemon that are in danger. We must rescue them, and Perilla and I will go on ahead. Let's move out! Okay, so is, are all the wild encounters here going to be just nuclear? Or can I find something regular to catch? Okay, they're all nuclear. Um, but if, when the nuclear Pokemon are gone from here, um, I'm allowed to catch them. Hold up, look there. Looks like that Pokemon's in trouble. Okay, uh, two nuclear Ekans. Oh, wait, what? Am I crazy or so? I thought those were Ekans. Whatever. Alright, Bashar. Uh, I don't have a Bashar, but I can check Tansker's primary typing. Alright, Tansker should be Dark Normal. But Giga Drain should also still be stronger just because Rock Smash is so weak. Oh yeah, I got rid of Leaf Blade because like, man, I just, I don't know. I think I just needed it. But I think we're going to target Bashoff instead. Just because it has Fighting Stab. Maybe, I don't know. It either has Fighting Stab or Dark Stab. So that one's the worst one. Okay, there you go. Bashoff is done. Half-Life. Oh. I think we should be fine. We have lefties. What is that? Two Arbox? What? No, 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 no. Oh, God. Wait, am I in a double battle? Please, no. Crud. Oh, boy. Right, Baron is dragon type, I think. Uh, the best I can do is metal claw. I think I metal claw Arbok. Um, now I think I switch to Butterball because Butterball pretty bulky, and also I'd say Butterball is the least valuable member of the team currently. Sorry, Butterball, but yeah. Uh, <laughs> no! Why do you miss? Oh, okay. They missed too. And crunch. That's good. Okay, defense sword. I I don't think that matters that much. Wait, that thing might be part dragon. I don't remember. So just sludge. Oh, okay. Apparently I did not double properly. Okay, another crunch. Dang, no! No, no! <gasps> oh! Oh my goodness, the clutch! The clutch! The absolute clutch! Butterball! Butterball forever. Butterball forever! I can't, I can't let him die after that. I can't. I cannot consciously let him go after that. Were we faster? We were faster, right? No, I don't think we were. Not faster. Great. All right. Well, let's hope we just don't get O code. Um, do we switch? I think we switch into Tubby. All right, Tubby, come on! Don't die on me now. Then we can Aqua Jet as well. <gasps> we O code. He lives! They both live to see another day! Oh, bro, that was- Yes, you do owe me one after that. I'm not even reading their text anymore. I don't care. Okay. Um, alright, I'll read now. 
I cannot thank you enough for your help out there, Jackson. If you hadn't been able to pull through in that last minute, we all would have been in serious trouble. I'm... I'm so glad. Seeing you battle with your Pokemon, fighting alongside you, it makes me wish I'd gotten to know you better before. Jackson, well done. As thanks for the indispensable help you brought to the Tandor Rangers today, please take this. Strengths! Okay. Now please, get as far from the site as you can. You have four gym badges, right? I don't know much about Pokemon training, but I'm fairly sure that your next badge is in Amateur Town. You'll have to go through Baikal Rainforest to get there, but based on how you handled those Pokemon today, I'm sure you can take care of yourself. Alright. That was kind of... close. I know this video might end up being a little short, but I think we're gonna end it here. So if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to smash that like button, hit the bell, subscribe, leave a comment, and share it to your friends. And I'll see you guys in the next video.